Scene building can come in handy when you're trying to find a specific map you want it. Especially when source filmmaker is limited on maps that you can't find in the workshop. For example, such as jungle environments, oceans, underwater, caves, mountains and deserts. Before we begin our first scene building, referencing images can be very useful for your films. This website is called Unsplash. It is full of inspirational images for referencing. Think of a scene you want to build, like a jungle scene. Let's say I want a jungle with fog, so I'll use a fog map. Next load up a model for props to build. I have some jungle props in the user mod folder. If you don't have the models that I have, props are linked in the description. If you do have any problems with your custom models like they're invisible, watch this video that I made about invisible models. To scale the model, right-click on the model, then select Add the Scale Control. Now select the slider and size it. If a big object is in the distance, make it smaller and away from the camera. If a smaller object is closer, Make it normal size or big close to the camera. Now you can duplicate them if you want for more props or thicken the bushes. Then select all of the props, shift left mouse. Then right-click and select Group Selected DAGs. If it's not working, go to the gear icon and check Show Scene Hierarchy. Now let's speed up the process to make this scene. Remember, take your time to build this for your scene. The more you spend time on your building maps, the more you're comfortable and getting good at building a maps.
Since you now have a scene build, how do you control the fog in SFM? It's simple. Hit F11 on your keyboard to go to the game world. Then hit this button to open up the console, then type in fog UI. Now check fog override and mess with the sliders. Start and end is how much you want the fog from point A to point B. On the right side is the colors of the fog. Down here is the background fog, which is the skybox outside of the map. Once you're done and happy with the result, X out the UIs and press F11 to exit the game world. Let's say we picked out a map we want to film, but you want him to make it look like he's in a different location. Let's load up a wall model behind the soldier, then add some props whatever you want to place. You can do this technique at any time if you don't feel like switch between maps in each shot. One more thing to cover is, if you want to change the skin of a model or a skybox. Right click on the model, then go to set skin. Then pick out a number you want to choose from. So that's one of the basics of scene building. If you want to know about custom textures, water objects, and other stuff, I'll save those for as a bonus tutorial. This video is only teaching you how to make a map with props for your films. In the later tutorial we will be discussing about camera controls, composition, and the animations with the camera. Leave a like if this tutorial is helpful. And I will see you next time.